sunlight, bird song. Nothing feels worse when there's no hope, no chance of anything. That incessant noise! I should smash this useless antique to pieces right now! Why must life always end up so sordid and hateful? I'm not crawling in there. I'm too riled up for that, and it's, it's just not dark enough anyway. All of this, these pathetic souvenirs from our relationship, they're all lies. I should tear all her filthy, disease-ridden clothes apart and burn them! It's just a book. Stupid, feeble-minded woman with her silly, menial things. What good will reading a fairy tale do me? God has never been there for me when I needed comfort. Why would he want to go out of his mysterious ways to help me now? I couldn't care less about this damn thing. Why torture myself trying to remember? I'm too upset to even think straight. I hate her so much. Everything she wore, just to lure me in. Not even these... Violent impulses give me the strength I need to open the armoire! What is wrong with me? All of this... these... Pathetic souvenirs from our relationship. They're all lies. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. All the real color faded from it long ago. It must be full of dust mites. I should burn it. I told her the rug was fine work like I know anything about handicrafts. But it's what the Empress wanted to hear, wasn't it? Why torture myself trying to remember? It's just a bunch of schmaltzy junk. A shrine to naivety. I don't see anything else of value. Her jewelry box. What is it doing here? I sit here on the train, taking me to my final farewell to the ones who brought me to this world. I see the smiling couples on their way to new adventures and think, that used to be us. We had joy and laughter and friends once, but a memory is not the thing itself. You're very good at letting things you don't want to face slip off you. You continue as if nothing has changed, lost in your own lifeless world. Words and dreams may be enough for you. You know what? You'll get a chance to test that soon. I question how I once saw things. How much of what I thought we had were my own feelings, and how much of your manipulation. Because you are so very good with words, aren't you? You knew how to use them when we met, and for the longest time, I went along with the romantic whirl you conjured up around our shabby, isolated existence. Oh, it took me long enough to see it for what it was. And there were these moments that you swept me off on foolish flights of fancy when I threw myself into your fantasies. You wove your spell, plying me with your magic and with wine in equal measure, and I was taken in like the lost little girl I was. Do you realize all the pain you've caused me? They say if you have to ask whether someone loves you, you already know the answer. Protestations to the contrary can no more convince me any more than I can make my own mother or father draw breath again. Your aloofness tells a different story. I no longer know what you're thinking. With my parents gone and with your refusal to even accompany me in my time of need, something broke, 
Or maybe it happened long ago, but I never saw it so clearly before, even after everything. I don't make you feel comfortable? Really? That's all you have to say? I won't waste any more life waiting for things that'll never come. Of course, that's what you expect me to do. Play the good wife so no one will laugh at you for being the failure you are, to shield you from the truth of your existence. Lost in your books and vapid verse, blithely drifting into the mists of time, as if not even a footnote, when you could be raking at it if you'd only used your words for anything other than personal indulgence. You talked and talked about your path, the winter blueness of my eyes, all that nonsense, and the years rolled by, the seasons came and went, on and on, you pursuing your dreams that will never be, lost in your damned words, looking for clues you'll never find. I'm sure you're doing it even now with your rotting books. You took the best years of my life, and gave only empty words in return. We've gone as far as we can, and something's got to give. Us. Is this where she kept her secrets? I should take a look inside. I should just destroy this useless junk, but not even the venom inside me gives me strength. I'm too upset to even think straight. I hate her so much. All of this, these pathetic souvenirs from our relationship, they're all lies. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. Why torture myself trying to remember? Too upset to even think straight. I hate her so much. All of this, these pathetic souvenirs from our relationship, they're all lies. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. It can't keep the time for five minutes straight chimes completely at random and never stops making that infernal noise but hey guess who thought it was so cute why torture myself trying to remember i'm too upset to even think straight i hate her so much